It's like you're screaming. What's up guys? It seems to be the moment we've been waiting for. I remounted my controller there and these strange looking aluminum and steel bars are to mount something very special that I've made. This is a battery I built. Um, I've got a BMS on there managing 18 cells for 75.6 volts fully charged a Bluetooth dongle there I can connect to my phone see everything about the battery and I built this battery box out of aluminum and plexiglass we'll get some shots of it here's me attempting to install the battery it's like 40 pounds Here's the battery on the bike. Um, you know, it looks kind of sketchy, but like it's, it's really solid. This is like a little one day build. Could definitely make something, you know, better, but it's really not that bad. An obvious thing you might be asking is, what about those pedals? Cause this battery is really big. So um, if I didn't mention earlier, it's 37 amp hours. 75 volts and 37 amp hours. These are pretty much useless right now. Um, I obviously don't have a chain on there, but even if I did, I like could not even reach the pedals. Like, look. So I'm gonna have to make some pegs out of bolts and nuts and anything I have around. So I don't have any hardware this size with this pitch. So I'm gonna have to go to the hardware store and pick some up. nut that goes on the axle of the motor right search the hardware store in and out on any absolutely nothing this size and this pitch I think it's m16 but it's got a weird pitch and I couldn't find anything what I'm gonna do is take these sleeves to make pegs and put the you know sleeve over the nut like that doesn't fit, gotta sand it, right? I could just use my hand and sandpaper, but where's the over-engineering in that? Check me out. Oh! You see where I'm going with this? You get it? Now. New tactic unlocked. Reload. Bolt with head same size as nut you know it's perfect oh. FYI I'm a professional dingus that is a vice but you guys didn't come here to see me making pegs so let's put them on this is what they're looking like pretty good I can definitely give them a little paint job too Maybe it's time to get on this little death trap. Got these pins set up here. I cut those pins, you know, to like a more appropriate length. Yeah, better test it. You can only imagine how I feel. I'm gonna ride this thing, I guess. All right, well, we're at 3.8 volts per cell. Audio sync. All right, let's try this out. Smooth so far. Like if I put my feet on the pedals, it looks like this. I don't know if you can see that. But it is ridiculous. Okay, and for all of you that like cheat on me for these rim brakes, you're actually kidding. Like, they're so powerful. And I have regen, so. Okay, that is fast. 
Oh my god. Oh my gosh. That just takes off. That is insane. Oh wow. Okay. Oh, it's my seat going down. Okay. That's that sound. accelerates so hard. That is insane. I'm a little too scared to ride it on the uh street yet, but we're just going to go on to the uh Love the silence. It's feeling pretty good. Has a lot more power. it stops thank you for all of those that care so much about my rim brakes because they they stop me pretty hard man this is so fast this is so fast I can actually drag race like you know that Mustang? I can drag race that Mustang in the wind probably. Definitely pushing the limits here. 
for sure. Anything hot? The motor's a little warm. But after doing pulls like that, I mean, come on. All right, we went down 0.1 volts on each cell. It's really well balanced. Um, thank you to this BMS. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my gosh. It's just freaking. This is freaking crazy. I need to take this thing to a track. We're gonna stay on level three on the pads. Oh my gosh. I'm scared of how fast this thing goes. Like on this bicycle frame. Try level five. 